Hello everyone, welcome back to Shortcode. Today I'm going to be showing you how to install third-party modules in Python. Third-party modules are really useful in Python, and almost all of your Python projects will need a third-party module. For example, if you want to make games with Python, you will need another module. By the way, I am currently making a Python games tutorial. It should be out soon. If you want to do machine learning, you will also need to download another third-party module for that. So this is a really key skill to learn, so make sure you stick around to the end of the video. So we are just on the desktop. Now open up command prompt. So command prompt. Here you need to type in pip. So just pip. And you should get all of this output right here. However, if you do get an error saying pip is not recognized or some sort of error, just follow along right now because we're going to fix it even though it's working right now. You want to search up Python, and you can see Python 3.7, you might have Python 3.8. You want to right click on it, open file location, and then right click, open file location, and then you want to go up to scripts in this Python 3.7 folder, and then click on the um, path, control C, or copy it. Okay, we can minimize this, and then we want to type in environment variables. And here we go. Then we want to press on environment variables. Under system variables, move down, press on path, edit, and then you'll want to press new, copy and paste that path in that we have just copied, then press OK. And as you can see, I've already got mine in here. C colon slash program file slash python 37 slash scripts. Press OK. 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 Now you should be good to go. So when we go back into command prompt, we should be able to type in, I'm just going to clear it, pip, and there we go. So now to install some modules. Let's just uh, test this out with a module that is used for making web applications, which is called Flask. If you would like me to make a tutorial series on how to make websites for Python, drop a like on this video and leave a comment saying you want to see it. Okay, so to install Flask, we'll do pip install flask and as you can see requirement already satisfied it's because i've already got um flask installed you should um get like some text saying installing and stuff okay so now to test that we have installed flask successfully or to test if you've installed any module correctly you'll want to go into idle into the python shell and then we'll do import fl flask and then you can see we don't get any errors, so that means Flask has been imported successfully. If we were to import a random module, no module named this because it hasn't been installed and it probably doesn't exist anyway. And if you do get an error, go back and run the pip command again, pip install the module name, and then it should work. Okay, that's it for installing modules. I'm going to end the video here. Drop a like in this video if it helps you out, it really it does help me out. If you would like to see a Flask tutorial where I teach you how to make a website, make sure to drop a comment saying you want to see one. Also consider subscribing, I post Python content almost every day. That's it from me, cheers and goodbye.